everyone. So today I'm gonna hike uh, in Switzerland in Grand Trish Park uh, near to Schwarzsee. The uh, weather is looking very good. It's uh, clear skies, 26 degrees, so even up, uh, maybe up to two kilometers high, it's gonna be still pretty uh, comfortable and warm. Uh, my hike is gonna take about three, four hours, I will see, but uh, I just would like to go on top of one of the uh, peaks uh, near the Schwarzsee. It's gonna be about um, 2,000, maybe a little bit more meters in altitude. Uh, I'm gonna have a dinner over there. I'm gonna cook uh, goulash soup uh, with my uh, little little gas stove. So I'm gonna film it as well, that as well, and just uh, and just uh, let's see how it goes. Okay, see you on the hike. Okay, so I've just started my hike. Uh, good thing it's, uh, as I told, it's uh, pretty warm, and now I am already at 1,065 meters altitude, and I am now deciding where to go because there are like three options. I think uh, I could go this direction, I could go that direction, even that direction, but I think I'm gonna choose this direction. I am not sure how high is up there, but uh, let's see should be pretty pretty nice so, yeah. okay so I came across uh, uh, some uh, directions but uh, the funny thing that there's no timing in kilometers how much is left to go some places but I assume this break uh, PT1378 it's the altitude of some place so I'm just gonna hit that direction and uh, let's see how it goes. Yeah, so when we have those first gates, you should never worry about them. And just go through. Uh, but there's a chance that maybe the fence uh, is maybe electric because we, I saw some cows here. I don't see, but uh, some cows can be locked. Yeah, what can I say? I just. Uh, it's just pity that through camera you can give up, you can't, how to say, give you the smell because the place smells very nice. Uh, freshly cut grass, mountains, fresh air, uh, lake over there. If you can see it, I hope. Yeah, it's just beautiful. Uh, let's see how it goes. I just hope that I can go over there. I saw from far away that is like a valley so i just go through this forest and hope i can go there i saw some snow so it should be quite chilly up there but it's no problem it should be very good okay see you later see some numbers so this break I think is uh, 55 minutes from here uh, but I should go at least to Cernier if I call it right say it right uh, but other places are much further and as you can see we are already in 1134 meters altitude okay just a little side note if you side note if you ever travel in Switzerland with your car and you think you're gonna go to some villages, do a hike, take it easy, just a little tip, always have at least up to five Swiss francs and coins in cash because even in very remote villages or even remote places, parking is mostly, you have to pay for parking. And the bad thing is you mostly cannot pay with mobile phone, so you must have cash. I had this problem many times that I forget to take cash, so I have to hustle, go to the bank, exchange that money to the coins and then pay it. So avoid it, always have it.
closed so animals don't run away okay so I'm just 35 minutes into the hike and the views you get are great the good thing about Switzerland is just like you maybe sometimes need just 10 minutes hike 20 minutes hike go up straight to the to the mountain and you're gonna get amazing views and I just done 186 meters gain in elevation so that's not that high that lake is not very far for me okay but it's just let's pushing up and take it easy like cows as animals Swiss Alps is the place to go for sure there's no hike with, uh, with no cows look yeah. nice okay let's continue okay so it seems that I made a mistake probably but maybe I will can I, I can fix it later uh, but you see those two small roads they are going different directions so I took the one which goes down and the another one will go us up so you can basically go to those uh, to the snow which is very cool uh, but I didn't take that route route but there was no direction on that uh, on that path so I don't know maybe it's private or something like that but uh, it leads to some very nice places and now I'm quite quite low still quite low I'm like 1254 meters so I don't know, I, I just hope that I can find pretty soon a, a route which goes up, up, up and I can reach at least 1700 meters of height or something like that. So uh, let's see how that goes. Okay, so I found this Oichelspass, Oichelspass. So that definitely takes me high because this is a mountain pass. So I hope we can get lucky. Let's go. Okay, so I walked maybe one kilometer from that side ocean pass and I got to this beautiful valley with cows and I think there are some uh, sheep probably, tractors, meadows, simply beautiful. So. I am not sure of this, there is that ocean spot. It can be over there, so just to pass those mountains, or it can be over there. So it doesn't matter. I, I want to pass this valley, and let's see where uh, will I get. And I think in the end of this valley, I'm gonna make my dinner, uh, which is gujlesh soup. I hope it's good. So let's go. So it seems that <coughs> Oichel Pass is that way, definitely not that way. It would be pretty cool to climb there, but where I see uh, no real paths, it can be slippery. Uh, some, it mostly grass, but some rocks as well can be falling, so you have to be attentive. If you go there, and maybe next time I can go there. So it seems I'm going this direction. Uh, and let's just see. But Oichel's Pass has to offer to us. Yeah, but uh, just look uh, overall how beautiful this place is. It's like a very nice valley. Mountains that direction. I came from there, that road. We have a cows with tractors over there. And here. And we have thousands, thousands of such places in Switzerland. As well in Austria, in Italy, in France. Man. We are lucky to have this beauty here. Okay, I think Oishel Spice is like 15 minutes, 15, 20 minutes uh, from this point.
Okay, so this is actually Oshu Pass. The views are pretty good. <clears throat> I'm gonna pass a bit because I wanna climb this small hill, which is pretty steep but looking very nice. And I think I'm gonna prepare my dinner over here. So let's see how it goes with that goulash soup on this nice little hill. And the uh, elevation is now 1573 meters. So it can be 1,600 on the top. So I didn't reach 2,000 today. Yeah, but it's no problem. It's still very beautiful. Still very beautiful. Okay, so now actually you can see a bit more of Auschwitz Pass. It goes down. So that is the top of Auschwitz Pass. It's maybe 1,550 meters in elevation. Yeah, so those peaks are definitely 2,000, even more. But I don't really see very good hiking paths up. I can see some down, but not really. Yeah, and those rock pile peaks are just beautiful. Here as well, look. Still snow, June 25th, still snow. Okay, so I'm gonna prepare my dinner, I think, on this beautiful rock. And let's see how it goes. Okay, so I bought this goulash soup in the shop. It's a uh, Rindfleisch, so I guess this is uh, some cow meat. I don't know, it was one euro or something like that. So let's just see how it goes. I'm gonna pour it in this small kettle. This is my gas stove and this is my spoon. Okay, I hope it, uh, it works out. Okay, so now it's cooking. It's hard to see the flame, but it's uh, for sure there. And the soup is getting hot. I really hope it's gonna be delicious. But I think everything in the mountains is delicious. Let's see. Oh man, just one minute and it's already boiling. I think that's gonna be enough, so I'll turn it off. Okay, let's take a taste. Okay, what can be a better place to taste it? Yeah, it's hot. Mm. Mm. For one euro, it's definitely for free. Mm, definitely. Very good. Okay, I'm gonna eat it and continue my way back. So this is gonna be my final point and I'm gonna take the same route back. Uh, it took me one hour 40 minutes to get here. It's not long, but it's enough. It's very hot here. Yeah, uh, hopefully uh, next week I'm gonna do some longer hikes, maybe five hours, six hours. Let's see. Yeah, but it's, uh, look, just look at this. Wow, that's beautiful. That's beautiful. Okay, see you on the way back. Okay, so dinner is finished. I can see it was pretty good. Uh, warm soup it's always good in the mountains so uh, I'm gonna take the same route back to the car so uh, I will not be filming uh, because it's all the same so a little bit more of statistics so the highest point today was 1601 meter altitude uh, to one uh, one way it was 6.5 kilometers so the whole hike should be about uh, 13 kilometers and uh, yeah it's hot, it's nice and uh, beautiful, almost no people. I met maybe five people today, so it's not that much, okay. So uh, I have uh, like 5.5 um, kilometers to go to, to, to the car and uh, see you on the next hikes. Bye.